went to go put that in the recycle and it bounced off and right here. Let's try that again. There. Okay, so welcome back you guys. Sorry for the uh, delay, but I was down here and my mom made some pancakes this morning. Um, there's actually, I ate three. She makes them pretty large. I ate three. There's one left in here. My Chinese is still back there. One with some rice right here. But right now, I'm going to go ahead and do the dishes. I just washed my hands. So, let us go ahead and get the dishes done. So you guys, um, my mom was just telling me, we'll just have a little dishwasher pep talk here. <laughs> um, my mom was just telling me that this January, for me specifically, has not been the most healthiest at all because I'm the one that's getting hit with the most crap. Like I had that respiratory virus for like two, two and a half weeks. Now I have this head cold this, I don't even know what to call this, head cold crap, and so, you know, she's just like, y you have to keep washing your hands, which I don't do very good with, I'll be honest, but, you know, for the past two days, I've been doing pretty well, but not that well, so, like I said, I just washed my hands upstairs after I went to the bathroom, so I'm able to touch the dishes, and then I'll wash them again when I'm done here. My fever actually did break. It probably broke overnight. Um, but I still feel really congested and really like drowsy ish still. Like I slept in until eleven. Kind of the same time that I did yesterday, but about thirty minutes I woke up about thirty minutes earlier. Um oops. I feel okay. I definitely got a lot more sleep last night than I did the night before because of my medicine that I took. So I felt a bit better. I definitely, whatever, how much, how long I had my fever, which is probably only a couple of hours, it broke overnight and I was completely fine. Um, but I don't know. I just don't think considering what January has given to me sick-wise and health-wise, I just don't think tomorrow, I, I don't know, it's like a what if, it's like depending on how I feel, I, I don't think also standing out in the cold tomorrow morning would be the best idea in my health condition, so it might be, I'm, I'm leaning towards no, I'm really leaning towards no. My cough that I have is not at all as bad as my last one. This cough is actually from congestion being uh, in my lungs and my chest. Not my chest, more my lungs, more my lungs. 
and I'm absolutely trying my best not to infect anybody else. Everybody, come on, everybody hates being sick. Am I am I right? Everybody hates being sick. Depend depend it doesn't even matter what it is, but you just hate being sick because you're so you're so run down that you you don't even want to eat. Like me yesterday. I didn't even want to I barely I told you in the beginning of the vlog, I told you I I didn't want to eat anything yesterday. The only thing I ate yesterday was Crackers and Chinese, and that was it. I absolutely did not have the appetite to eat uh, a single thing. I was just like, no, my body does not have the energy. on my countertop and I'll show you when I'm done here with the dishes. Um, it looks like we're having a manwich tonight. That's actually quite a family favorite. I happen to enjoy manwich a lot. Um, and I will be actually going out to check the mail in mm, the next half hour or so. It probably the mail just arrived so I want to wait for a little while. But I do have to go check because I didn't check it yesterday. So I might have quite a bit of mail as well. But like I said, I don't know if I don't know if I'll be going into work because like I said, it depends on what my body feels like. I definitely, like I said, I definitely slept better last night than I did the night before. So, that's a plus. But, I mean, I'm just... <coughs> I... I don't know. My mom, I was like, I said to my mom last night, I said, do I have a fever? Because I always like to check if an illness lasts for more than a week or up to at least three days I like to check if I have a fever or not depending on if it's gonna get worse or it's worsening or whatever she felt my forehead she just does the old hand on your forehead check as most parents do she felt my forehead and she said that um, I did feel a bit warm
so she said that I felt a bit warm. Um, she went upstairs and got a thermometer, and lo and behold, my temperature was just about 101, just just below or above 101. So I did have a low fever. Um, it like I said, it broke overnight. Oops, I forgot this. overnight so I'm happy with that and I'm happy that I've gained my appetite back slowly considering I eat three pancakes <laughs> for my food plus I have Chinese left over so I might eat that tonight or tomorrow depending on if I go to work or not we'll see been like the dishwasher chat. <laughs> and I'm sorry for the loud noise. That's just what happens when you do dishes. these dumb things. How many of you have heard of these? These so-called butter knives, but they they look like they could be like a spoon, but they're they're definitely in the night in the form of a knife. How many of you have seen these?
was a fail. <laughs> which actually is not very much like here here is before Here's the after. Clean sink. Set up for dinner, which is manwich. And there we go. But right now it is 2:14. Something's wrong with my microwave. I think. I just have to press the. There you go. Right there. So it's 2.14. Um, but I think I'm going to go ahead and um, wrap up the vlog. Hopefully I get enough footage for a better vlog than yesterday. I apologize for that, but I was just, I mean, come on you guys. I was so sick. I was not, <laughs> like, I am still very sick. I was not feeling good. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching.